We've been together going on 11 years. Yeah, so um, we've been married for four years. No, we've been married for longer than four years. We've been married for almost uh, six years this past uh, July. We've been together probably, uh, it'll be 11 years in November dating. One son, he's uh, 14 months, and uh, we have one that's due in January. Also a boy. Well, uh, the first time I saw him, we were at a, I guess Russellville was having a basketball tournament. We were in ninth grade uh, playing basketball, junior high basketball, and uh, we had a tournament in Russellville. I went to Dardanelle and she went to Russellville. She, um, she came there with some of her friends to, uh, to watch the games, and all the girls that were her friends were saying how cute I was and all this stuff. This is, this is what they said. Anyways, they were saying how cute I was and all this stuff and uh... I remember one of my friends saying who he was, I didn't really think much about it. And then later that night, um, I think it was two nights later, we decided to all go to the movies. After we got done with the tournament, we went to the Stobies and while we were eating there, that group of girls were there and they, they kept saying, we, you should go to the movies tonight, you should go to the movies tonight. And there was one in particular that was her friend named Taylor. Well, my friend had just broken up with her boyfriend and I guess, I don't know if she messaged Zach and his friends or I don't know what really happened. And uh, she was wanting to go to the movies to meet me kind of as a fallback because she had just broken up with her boyfriend. So I was like, well, you know, it's fine, you know, a chance to maybe get a kiss from a girl at the movies or whatever you do at 14 years old. And so I was okay with it. And uh, so that night... We went to the movies and we went to the bowling alley. And then we decided to watch the movies and then they were there. And well, when we got there, they were, um, they were all in their little huddle and we were all in our little huddle and we were all talking about, you know, who looked the best over there. And they probably wasn't even paying attention to us. At that point, I uh, wasn't really worried about guys in general. Um, I had just broke up with somebody, so I was like, whatever. I seen Kayla, and she was in this group that I was supposed to be meeting one of the girls, but it was, I do believe in love at first sight, and that's what it was. So I went up there, and I usually never have any trouble talking to girls. Usually I can talk to anybody, but I kind of got you know, starstruck. I was like, oh God, you know, she's, she's gorgeous. And so I walked up to her and, uh, and I was like, hey, I was like, um, are y'all, what movie are y'all watching? And I think she, they said they were watching uh, uh, Harry Potter or something, something like that. And, and we were watching Chicken Little because I knew that was a movie that if I did get to take a girl in there, maybe I would get a kiss because it was a little kid's movie. So um, it was my chance to try to meet a girl. And then she actually had a friend that I knew um, was gay. And I walked up to her and I tried to make conversation with her because I didn't know what to say. So I said, he, I remember him asking me if he was gay and it really made me mad. I was like, I don't even know you. Why are you asking me this? And one of my biggest pet peeves is like people that are cocky. And the whole time that we were around him, of course, this was like before we went into the movies, he was acting like that. And I like, I don't like this kid. He's getting on my nerves. Anyway, she didn't, she, she thought I was a jerk when we first met, and it was just because I didn't know what to say to her, and I, it, something that usually comes so easy didn't come easy to me, because she just made me nervous. But anyways, so we ended up, uh, she ended up going to uh, Harry Potter. I went to Chicken Little, and uh, I went, with, uh, I ended up going to the movies with another girl, talking to another girl that night, but it was kind of like, the whole time I was talking to this girl, I, all I could think about was this girl named Kayla. After that, I didn't really talk to him for a while, and I guess he had asked my friends about me, and asked, I think back then we had like MSN Messenger, so um, he was asking what my email was, and I guess he got it from one of my friends, and he messaged me on there, and we've been together ever since.